Today, we're gonna be going over all the releases set to drop this month in September. And there's definitely a couple bangers dropping this month. So let's go ahead and get into the first shoe. We have the Air Jordan 1 OG High Palomino. So this one in particular actually came out today. No oh, dope. <laughs> so you didn't get it yet. <laughs> I've been busy. Um, oh yeah. <laughs> but I do plan on picking these up for the collection. Uh, I think aligns with like Mocha Ones is a shoe that everybody went crazy over because it was like they called it the poor man Travis Scott. And then this is like color blocking like the bread one, but it's giving you that same vibe. So for me. I could see why this could potentially be that $500 shoe down the line. For sure. Um, and the or, materials look good. Right, or you could say, hey, Jordan 1 hype is down right now. People aren't really rocking with it. You can get it for a good price. I haven't checked market on these yet, which I probably should right now. But, yeah. or you can tell us what you feel about it and I'll look it I up. I feel like it's a good shoe. I think it's gonna be a sleeper. People might say, oh, I ain't gonna get it yet. But because you're talking about the Jordan 1 being down, mm -hmm. but I think it's a must have in a collection. I think it's gonna go up. I love the shoe. Like, oh, yeah. so I, these, it's gonna hit to these me. These are cheap right now. Like, two, two thirty is for a size thirteen. Oh. Retail is one hundred and eighty bucks. So it's going just over retail after fees Perfect. and stuff. People are barely making money on these. Perfect. That's what you want. This is the shoe. Then it can go up later, and you make your money. So this is like you buy ten pairs and you sit on them and you it, like have a couple. For I would. You. I would say get a couple pairs. I mean, like, some people can't afford to buy ten pairs, right? Mm -hmm. You know, but. There's people out there that get a four, two, three pair, mm -hmm. and then you sell one and it gets yours become free, mm -hmm. you know, no, over time. Sure. This is definitely one of those that yeah. have that potential. And I, yeah. I feel that. And I think it's gonna be a dope shoe to rock, especially going into the fall time and the winter and everything. Yeah. For sure. I'm, yeah, I'll make a full review on this shoe once mm. I get them in hand. Uh, it just looked, the leather look looked nice. nice. Yeah, they look, look nice. nice. <laughs> okay, so oh next up right God. here, you have the FIBA Air Jordan 38. We already talked about the 38 in the past, the model. The color blocking on this is way better than the last one we looked at. Remember the black and white one that we yeah, looked at? But I'm still on the fence about this <laughs> shoe. <laughs> I think these make them look a lot better though. They do. With the color blocking. But. It's a hoop shoe. It's not a wear it out in the streets type thing. Uh, but yeah, and, okay. As a hoop shoe, it'll probably do fine and hoop in it. But if you're trying to, you know, put that fit together and you're gonna go out there and be fancy. Not with jeans. With jeans and your socks pulled up. Oh, <laughs> with the jeans tucked in the socks? <laughs> Hell no. Okay, so retail on these is like 200 bucks uh, for a hoop shoe for performance. Is that worth right. it, do you think? I don't know. I mean, for a hoop shoe performance, if it's gonna do what it do, it might work, but I still say no. I'm still on that 150, 170. Right. Well, live. times have changed. It's like oh my God. 180, 200, 225 now. That's a lot for a pair of I shoes. I heard that the Jordan 17s or something supposed to, like they're supposed to release the 17s again. Mm -hmm. I heard they're supposed to be either like 280 or 300 bucks retail. What? It's like a crazy, yeah, I don't know. We'll talk about that we'll later. We'll talk about that later because <laughs> Nike, Jordan brand, we got something to talk about. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so next up right here, you got the Eastside Golf. Remember we talked about the Air Jordan 12 yeah. in the past with like the yeah. tan with the stuff on there? So this is a golf bottom, Air Jordan 1 high. That's kind of clean though for a golf shoe. You like these? Like if you're gonna go golfing, like that's kind of clean. You can do that's that clean. if you go golfing. So you got the golfer with the gold chain yeah. right here with the swing, you got the jump yeah, on I can the do other that. side. You got that that the pine green vibe to it with the you know Jordan yeah. One. You got the little hits right here on the swoosh, the gold Air Wings logo. Um, what does it say on the Jordan swoosh? Wings logo. Swoosh. Uh, I think it just says Eastside Golf with that oh. that same kind of text oh, that see, you see, see on the insole right there. Yeah. So overall, a clean shoe, but it's for golfing. You know what I'm saying? It's right. not really like you're about you to be out on the streets. But you can get fancy when you're golfing. Okay, all this. but now retail, one eighty, two hundred bucks. No, I can see that in golf. Okay. Because golf is, it is golf. it's a prestige it, it, yeah. kind of thing and you're gonna spend some money. I get that, I get that. You know, so I can kind of see that in golf. And, and look at how much you play for one driver. No, this is true, <laughs> this is true. So the next one is a part of that same release, 
the East Side Golf. Now these for me, cause you know I love me some Jordan sixes. Yeah. The Air Jordan six low East Side Golf. So this is like the Oreo sixes, right. but they added that green splash to the bottom. They got the embroidery with the swing on the. Those are clean the too, right there. I'd be wearing the the high tops. You'd be wearing those. Yeah. For sure. Right. I'm pulling up in the low tops. You're pulling up in the highs. Yeah. All day. Yeah, for All sure. All day. It's so, a good looking shoe though. They, they are clean. They did good on that. Retail though. Not over 200. 240. Oh my God. Well, they got the spikes though. Yeah, I think, well, oh yeah, because other ones it's don't got, got the spikes. spikes. Yeah. So okay. I can see that. Okay, okay. You got the spike in there. <sighs> the question is, should and it's I probably got those interchangeables. You think it got those interchangeable spikes? The different the ones you can change? Right. Should I add these mm -hmm. to my collection? Oh, for sure. And then I'll go beat you in golf. And then you'll lose to me again. I've been terrible lately. Oh my God. I'm, if we was talking about golf right now. All right, so next the up we got the- game is on. I've been down bad. <laughs> so it was the clubs. <laughs> Not blaming no, it all on the clubs. clubs is like six inches short. No, my clubs is too short. And then, yeah, yeah it was a, I've been, I found some clubs now, so we good. <laughs> but all right, Air Jordan 1, Tatum, oh, or God. Air Jordan Tatum 1. Okay. These are called the home teams. No, they should be the go aways. It <laughs> <laughs> should be the aways. What do you think about the colorway? No, they cannot. This shoe is so hard because the design yeah. is so hard. You got to keep it simple. <sighs> y'all know, if y'all seen in the past videos with me and this shoe, it's. I think they only had one color blocked in that I really liked. Yeah, the white with the UNC blue. Yeah, yeah. the rest okay. of them trash. Okay, but look though. Trash. Like, who does this match with? Like, you know what I'm saying? It's like Lime nobody. Green, like Miami. Uh, no. You know what I'm saying? Like, no and it's team. It's not even fully Miami vibe. There's no team. So, <sighs> you just get. I'm just. I they blew it. it. I can't do it. Blew it. That's and, all I'm and and I think they want to disrespect Jason just for. Shut it. up. <laughs> 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 and tell him it's his fault for not selling the shoes. It's not the color. It's not the shoe. It's the colorway. You know how they're like, it's yeah, not yeah, you, it's, it's me. Not <laughs> it's not the shoe. It's the colorway. <laughs> like, who's on the colorway design team here? Who is doing this? <laughs> okay. They so, need us on there. Hey, y'all need to get us on there for one collab on these Jason Tatum's hey, and we'll make it right. Let's get it right, man. Oh so the FIBA uh, Air Jordan 1 Comfort. That's a high top. Yeah, so it's a comfort series. So when mm. they do this, it's again, comfortable shoes. Right. They build the inside is different. The materials is different on how so to make it more comfortable and you know, uh, coming around the ankle when you tie the shoe up and everything. So, and they always end up doing solid materials and stuff on these types of shoes. It looked like I just couldn't wear it. But for me, it's a no-go. It's a no-go. I'm gonna have to pass on it, but it looks like a clean shoe. I like the bottom though. That's what they do on the comfort bottoms. And you can see like the area yeah. and everything. No, they hit on that bottom, but they blew it when they got to the top. <laughs> <laughs> Retail, 150, 150 bucks. That's not bad. And then we're gonna go into the yeah. Nike stores, it might be like 80. So, okay. This one, um, mm -hmm. Air Jordan 4, red cement. So you know the white cement 4 is a classic OG colorway with the gray instead of the red. Mm -hmm. They switched it up and added red. Now, normally I say <laughs> you can take shoes and add uh, any color to it with the basic color blocking and it'll be dope. This scenario, not really. I like the shoe. Come on, you don't like this? I think they just like, you know, they cool. They whatever. But it's clean. It's this clean. is the one you get the fit on and you're going to go out, hey, take your girl on the first date. What a whole say, fit. What a the whole, whole fit. fit. She's going to be like, man, he nice. I'm rocking sweat. He's so clean. I'm chilling. Oh. I'm pulling up with these on like a rainy oh, day. You want to take her and get you a nice tomahawk steak, 22 ounce. <laughs> I'm like. <laughs> He's like, we're not doing that. We're going to get some sushi. <laughs> get some oodles and noodles. Yeah, you, know, you know what I'm saying? So I these, think for me, it's a cop. I think this is the shoe that kind of sets the new tone. And they got the tone. jump in. I think this is the shoe that sets the new tone for the Air Jordan 4. Like, the 4 is the hottest shoe right now. It's hype, 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 yeah. hype. I think a lot of people are expecting all the Jordan 4s, to, you know, because at one point, every single Jordan 4, 350 bucks plus, right? Right. But this one, and you know, as of late, we're starting to see those prices aren't like that. The economy, a lot of different factors. Oh yeah, yeah. Kids can't afford these shoes like that anyways. Some but, adults you know, can't afford the shoes right. like this. No, for real. And this is the shoe that is kind of like, I feel like that tipping point when it comes to the Jordan 4 of like, ooh, maybe it's losing that. What's the retail? 
Uh, I think it's like 210 or something like that. 210. But that's a... Man, I, that's a cop to me. I, I can see why it's a cop. Like, I'm not like running away from the shoe type thing, but I'm not gonna be like, this top 10 shoe. Top, no, it's not a top, top 10, 15. but like, it's a clean I'm not about shoe. to be gassing up this shoe at all. I they think this is a shoe that once I get it in hand, I'll make my decision if I wanna keep it. But again, it would also be one of the shoes that's like, oh, I got these in my collection and they could easily be on the chopping block if I was like doing a trade or something like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna wear them. I feel that. Them is clean to me. <laughs> I'm gonna wear. I'm gonna step out of it. No size 14, if y'all know. He needs a 14. I need a, a 14, 14 right here. <laughs> Woo! Okay, I'm back. Okay. So also, um, on this day, I'm pretty sure we saw this one, the soft pink Air Jordan 2. We oh, yeah. talked about this one in the past, um, but it looks like it's scheduled to come out as well. So we'll kind of make it quick on this one. We're both <laughs> like, it's a cool shoe, but it's not really for us type thing. They did. Yeah. It looks like the materials are nice. Great job. Great yeah, for yeah. girls. You know what I'm saying? But pass Great on that girls. one. Yeah, okay. So also on September 9th, it's going to be sneakers day. Remember we talked about this? Oh like, yeah, yeah, so yeah. This isn't on um, this release, but everybody's expecting sneakers day. So basically what that is, is uh, sneakers app has a special day of the year. Like we got Air Max day, different stuff like that. Right. right? right. So this is like a new thing for sneakers app. And then they do like restocks on all the hype releases. Now we were talking about that, which we can go off on this tangent or we can stay on track, but- I wanna go off for a few, just like a good minute, minute and a half. Okay, so this, okay. tell them what we were talking about the other day. So when you guys see these secret uh, sneaker drops they're gonna do and they're gonna drop all these hype shoes, whatever. Mm -hmm. I feel like Nike's dropping the ball, and Jordan brand is dropping the ball on doing this. Because- they're You're killing the hype yep. on the hard ways to get the shoes. And we know that the resale is what keeps the hype going because you couldn't get them like right. all the way around, like the full circle. But if people know that you're going to come back and you're going to redrop 10, 12 shoes that people couldn't get. Again and again and again and, and again. And again and again. So you're right. just depleting the value. They're going to raise the price for like 20 bucks a right. shoe so they can make their money but they're gonna blow it for the people who spent, I'm gonna say the shoe value was 700. Well, now it come back out again at 250. People gonna say they ain't gonna want the shoe. So why are we going to try to find the shoe? They're blowing it. Right, so basically the whole supply and demand concept, right? But behind that, you're also thinking like, I wanna have something that's exclusive. It's not about being a hype beast or all the other right. things, but it is dope to go right. out and have the hunt of going after that sneaker, getting that exclusive shoe, whatever it may be in your collection. And then it's like two weeks later or six months later, you're like, bro, they're dropping it again for retail. Right. Everybody just yeah. got the easy cop. I had to yeah. go through this thing. like, And it's like, yeah, that's great. Yeah, you want everybody to have the shoe. But at the same time, it's like, nah, it's kind of dope to have like the levels and tiers to sneakers uh, where there's like a general release, a limited release, a PE, a this, a that, right? I think that's super dope. And I, there's all those elements, whether it's yeah. collecting cars, yep. collecting toys, yep. collecting cards, you name it. Every collecting type game has those elements to it. And if you take it and say it's collectible today, right? and then next year, all the value say, I'm gonna give a number, it was worth a thousand bucks. right? And then you dropped, a million of them. The same exact thing. Same, everything. You didn't change nothing. A million of them. Well, the value of all the 1 million and the 500 you made prior all went down. And it's not about the value just for the sneaker head to make the resale money, but it's also for the brand. No, it, it, no. Like, when, when I say value, right. I'm not meaning cost and number. Exactly. I'm, I'm talking about do I want or don't want. Right. Like nobody wants what everybody's gonna wear. Cause you're literally gonna be always, what do I always say? Attack of the clones. The new shoe comes this out. Is what everybody's wearing it the whole here. weekend. Oh, the whole weekend. <laughs> you just go to the mall, you go somewhere, and you go to the out. You, everybody gets, when there was uh, those with the red ones, the, with the uh, red 11s or whatever. Oh, the all red 11s, the white and red yeah. 11s. Yeah. When those came out, oh my gosh. Everybody. They made so many of those shoes. They yeah. was everywhere. And I think it's dope. Again, I think it's dope for shoes to be like that. But at the same time, when it comes to those limited releases, that's where Need it's to a stay limited, limited. Release, a limited release. It's the same thing. It's like, yeah, I don't know. Again, there's levels to it. Levels to real estate, right? Like you can buy this type of home, you can buy a manufactured home, you can buy a mobile home, you can buy a smaller home, you can buy 3,000 square foot, a million dollar home. But if home. you bought a, I'm gonna say, a, a, a $500,000 house right. in a neighborhood that's 
uh, a three hundred dollars dollar house neighborhood right? right and you got a you just built this five hundred thousand right. dollar house they were like oh my god look at that and then around the corner they did cookie cutters of your house and lined up five of them yep right it's like well it ain't nothing anymore right because they're all there it's nothing and then it's going to be like it might lower the value on comps for the house because because <laughs> they're going to be like well <laughs> these are all cool and people are going to pay that much they don't want to pay too much more so your five hundred thousand dollar house is now right. 375 yeah. 425 you're like damn i'm right. losing equity losing. <laughs> but I'm, i don't know again that's a small tangent we could go off and other people Just, say you know we say attack of the clones and we're like well it all about the fit you pull off it's all about the no, fit i'm like no, i get that no. too yeah 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 cool i just all, don't but. want uh we're gonna end this here in a second but i don't want nike or jordan brand to blow it of them trying to get in the game of what's out there and trying to raise the price and put the shoe out there for the public right. for so many and then now they become like the normal air force one that they can sell for 44 dollars right you know everywhere for a long period of time because nobody's gonna reach for it it's just, oh, i'll get it when i can i'll get this when i can right and it's gonna waste the whole thing yeah no i can see that and everybody said the same thing not only is it shoes are releasing it feels like every or other day or every day of the month at this point this is just jordans we're talking about we're not even talking about nikes with the sbs and the adidas and the new balance right. and the other companies it feels like their shoes releasing every single day literally and remember jordans used to just drop on saturdays right you go camp out you get the shoe or really even farther back you didn't even need, was need once a camp a out. yeah you didn't even need a camp out it was yeah. just like there was in the mall you pulled up yeah. or they was at the nike town and he was like oh i pulled up on a wednesday and the shoe's still here there. right now Every day of the week, it's some type of release. It's always something going on. It's wake up in the morning, trying to get on the job, da, 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 missing on this. It's like, it's just a lot. It's yeah. a lot. I know everybody can't afford it. I get that too. But I think they're taking away from the, like you said, oh, I missed that drop. The I culture. got him. Like, well, it don't matter. I right. missed it anyway. Something else is going to come right. out. Right. The culture of yeah. collecting shoes. Um, we were talking about that on TikTok too. Like the sneaker culture of camping out versus right getting shoes online yeah you know what i'm saying it's whole the, totally you have different. human interactions with people you're online and with a bunch of people that never speak with each other and then it's like they can't even communicate with you when you meet them in person because they're just so busy buying stuff online mm -hmm. which again pros and cons of both sides all right we're gonna go to the we're next back year. to it we had to go for a rant it was probably over a minute and a half but <laughs> definitely over a minute and a half all right so laney air jordan one ko this one right here high school colors for you High school colors, I just wish it wasn't canvas. That looked like canvas. It is. Yeah. It's the KO. It's the KO version. Yeah. OG cut. I, I do like it though. But for me personally, I'd have to have it because it's high school colors. Okay. Right. The average person might not do it in canvas, but uh, 150 I still bucks. Do it. 150 oh, perfect bucks. pricing. So that's the type of shoe I'm like, get it at outlets, get it on sale, yeah. catch it like no hype for the no low. nothing. You It'd know be what I'm cool. saying? Easy. Yep. Okay, so cacao what wow. What is that? Cow, it's a wow, kid. Wow. It's a kid shoe. Oh, okay, because we're not gonna pow wow, cow wow on that. None one. of that right there. So <laughs> color blocking the green, blue, whatever you want to call that, with the browns and everything. Don't do that. We're gonna have to pass. Even as a kid shoe, I'm like, where, where would you what wear this? Kid shoe? would it? No, yeah. there's no outfit the kid would wear. Well, then the thing is, they made a four that goes with it. Blue that. Look at that. They wrap that right around the corner and go, well, it's going downhill already. Just <laughs> keep going downhill. <laughs> it's like, throw it on some threes and some fives. <laughs> They're like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> pump your scrap brakes. It, scrap the project. They're like, can we keep two? All right, ones and fours. Those are the hottest two models right now. <laughs> no, no. Come on, they blew that. For kids, kids be like, you brought me this. <laughs> I spent 150. What is it? 150 dollars for yeah, kids? Yeah, that's down bad. Oh my god. Okay, so this is a I women's release. I wouldn't put you in those either. No, <laughs> this is a women's release. You got the satin laces. You got that cream on the upper white right there. Clean shoe. It's clean. Can't go wrong. And with it. and for the women's shoe, the satin laces is dope. Air Jordan a One. Dope touch. Give it like that more upscale vibe to it. Yeah, it's a but dope touch. But for 180 bucks. Okay, they need to go down to about 150. Quality is gonna be there, but it's just it's but, I, but, this shoe. The quality is gonna be there, and I'm mean, but I keep saying the same thing. Women's shoes should not cost the same as the dude's shoe when you go in the size. <laughs> right? It's a small. It's less material. Yep. <sighs> and okay. you can't tell me there's a proven fact too. 
You can't tell me that the women's shoe is built just as good as the guy's shoe. Right. It's not. Right. They just make it straight lifestyle, <laughs> no nothing else. Okay, right here. Right. Air Jordan 2, Air, I keep saying Air Jordan 2. Air Jordan Luca 2. Uh -huh. What right color here. is this? Where are we going? Go back. Oh, Lake Bled. Oh, maybe it's something out like where he's from. I don't know. I didn't hear, yeah. I didn't look at the whole story for everything. But honestly, I like it. This is cool. I like it. Like, I like it. These is icy, like for real. They got the icy bottoms. They look, look icy. Like, I like it. This is cool. It's clean. I like, I like how they did the, the laces. laces. Yep. See what I'm saying? <laughs> See what I'm saying? They did that. <laughs> this is no, cool. they this did is cool. that. So is that going into the? Uh, where's that going it's two into? Two sets of laces. And they did that. Yeah. No, they did that. And that pulls around the backside. Yeah. That's hard. Oh no, that's the first time I haven't seen that. Yeah. So I think because the Luca one was out, now they're on the Luca two. Yeah, but I haven't seen the lace. Like, well, the color's probably helping it too. Yeah. But the way they did that. Oh. Yeah, yeah. No, this looks good. Okay, so this is a cop. That's a copper 140 shirt. 140 bucks. Oh, that's even better. Get buckets. The Kobe's, LeBron's, the low tops is going for more than that. Get buckets. <laughs> no, that's okay. Funny. PSG, uh, it's a soccer team, Paris. Uh huh. So they have done collabs in the past. We've seen fours, we've seen fives. Ooh, actually, speaking of that, Which I got that? some samples. <laughs> You always got something. I just thought about that. The PSG, <laughs> the friends and family. You get more shoes than Nike. Stay tuned. <laughs> I'll be showing those soon. Those are clean though. So this is a low top version. I think it's a clean shoe. I like Jordan 6s. I'm not mad at it, but at the same time, it's a pass for me. I'm like, I'm not spending my money on it. Because I'm I just, I'm not doing it. You got to have those in no. the collection. I know, I get it. You, you're going to have those. And when you have these, I'm going to take a picture of his feet and we're going to repost it. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to end up having these. Watch. As of right now, I'm saying no. I'm saying no. You're going to be in these. You know it. I love me some sixes. It's but got a little your, bit of orange on but, there. But with your, with, your, with your new brand, with your brand, look at this. With your brand in that. Shop DNA. <laughs> You know that'll kill him. ShopDNAShow.com. Okay. Chutneys. Chutney, Chutney, whatever people want to call it. Air Jordan 5 Low. I think we talked about this in the past, like a long time ago. I like the shoe though. This is clean. I think this is clean. Like you got the, the 3M tongue right there, dark 3M on the tongue. A lot of people don't like low top fives. You like low top fives a I lot. I like low top a fives. A lot. And you had those clots. You'd be rocking those actually. Yeah. I just saw you was wearing those. Yeah. Day. Yeah. Yeah, I think this is a clean shoe. Again, kind of aligns with your school colors with they're all yellow. You know? Right. I, so, I'll wear them. I for me, it's a pass. <sighs> it's a pass. But I really like this but shoe. But that got that grown man vibe still. Like Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it's an old man. Not grown man, but it like old a man. more old man vibe. Like old man pull up 40, with the yellow shoes on. Like the 40 it up. Ah, we even killed him out there. Yeah. And he's like, oh <laughs> well, this is my shoe. We going to this shoe right yeah. here? Yeah. Air Jordan 11 low, i.e. black and white. So this one, we've seen the OG colorways, but they made it simple, but it's, ah, oh, man, what is that right there? It's like a canvas or something. They changed it. Okay, they it looks changed like, it. honestly though, hold on, hear me out. This gives grown man vibes. You got the patent leather with the canvas on the upper. No, what I'm gonna tell you is, this is one of my favorite shoes of all time. I know. This shoe is so comfortable. If you guys ever have a chance the to get originals, these shoes, the originals, yeah, the originals, the new ones, they're not. I don't as know yet. The, yeah, new, ones, the new, new ones aren't as comfortable. But the originals was so comfortable. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, I wore those to death. Okay, so this one you can't go wrong with. It's gonna be easy cop. You're gonna be able to get this probably on sale or for retail with no problem. Take your time grabbing this shoe. If they get close, take your time. If they get close to the comfort, I'd say get two pair. These are gonna be sitting. If they sitting, I need three pair. You ain't getting three pairs of those. I know oh. it. All right, <laughs> J Balvin's. You know why I get it? Cause he did. He just said, no, you're not getting them. So I'm that not means I'm them. not getting them. <laughs> <laughs> not on my watch, buddy. <laughs> All right, 250 bucks, J Balvin Air Jordan 3. These go crazy. I think these are dope. Okay, so this is the backside. So it has like the sunset. I like the two, but the, the two back sides of the shoe with the happy face and the, mm -hmm. you know, that's cool. But this is not a cop. This shoe. This has no excitement to the shoe. Really? 
The materials on these are gonna be nice. I've seen pictures like, not just these, but some homies already sent me some photos of them and I might be picking them Watch up. Watch them go, I got a pair right here. <laughs> I might be picking them up tomorrow. <laughs> But <laughs> when you see him in person, don't change your mind because I'm telling you right now. Oh, well, right now. This is hard. And there's a black pair too. They made a black pair. Now, see, if we're going in a black pair, that'd be different. The black pair. But but right now, I'm going. That's not really a cob. Remember the Amon 3s? The ones that I wore for my wedding? Yeah, I like those. Those and these are going to have that kind of debate because they're similar. Obviously, the paint job is going to be different with the sunset vibe on it. Yeah. But the materials and the overall color blocking because the whole shoe's got that tan on it. People are gonna be like, yo, like, which one's better? Type I think thing? he's gonna be up there with DJ Khaled, and they're gonna sit. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. All right, look at that. Tell me that ain't clean. That's not it. That's not it? No. They look like the Amaz with the paint job on the back. We don't want the paint job. <laughs> no. This, no. Hey, throw on some pants, cover up the backside. See, now you gotta cover up the shoe. <laughs> You don't, you don't want to cover up the shoe. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't, like, they did the, you yeah. know me, I'm not really with the rainbow things. No, okay, so his, his uh, J Balvin 2s, they were like 350 or something like that because they had a light inside the tongue. And now nobody even wants them for like 150 bucks. You see what I'm saying? They blew it. Remember what we talked about? You keep doing these collabs and yep. you, you're going to blow it. Keep doing it too much and you're trying to come up to, oh, well, you did so good on this one. Yep. And... I would say this, if you're gonna do the collab, wait, you know, some years in between. It'd be like. They're doing the collab right off the back like J Balvin got, got sock in the shoe. All right, a little bit off topic real quick. I just wanna see what you think about this collab uh -oh. right here. Wait these a minute, just, how do you just pull some shoes out? These just came out. Uh, no, I've seen this, where did I see this? Uh, I don't know, but these just you came out. you have this? Yeah, I made a video already. Oh, okay, yeah. Now see, I think it's a cool shoe, but still, it's it's a cop. It's a cop. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> it's, a it's a cop now. Huh? Yeah, it's a cop. I think they're nice. I like them, but again, like the other collabs from the past for yeah. Union, like yeah. this is the worst one when it comes to the Jordan yeah. One. So it's like the well to ran dry but, at the same time. But I, I like it how they, they did that design. Yeah, because again, they gave the old man vibe because remember the old man had that crocus sack looking shit, yep, yep. you know? So they did that. Okay, all right. So well, that's a cop. All right, <laughs> on to next time. <laughs> Air Jordan 2 black cement right here. Clean shoe, all black. You got the black cement vibes like the threes, but they put it on the two. And you can't go wrong. But for me, you got to have these. Two pair. It's a pass. Two pair. Give me two, two pairs. Pair. This hey, is not this it. This is a two pair shoe. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do I'll it. I will. I think these are fire. I think this is like something that for sure when, man, I remember. And the two's been better on the comfort. Yeah. I remember when the Jordan twos started retroing again back in like 2009 or something like mm -hmm. that. And they had like the candy pack and they did like the oh, all yeah, red, yeah. the all blue, the all yellow, da da da. And they had the uh, anniversary, the all white with the 3M on there. And they had all the different colors dropping at the time. I can't with the all black. But I'm listening. This like reminds me of that era. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like that, that was like about 12 years, 15 yeah, years yeah, ago, yeah, a little while ago. But it reminds me of that era and it gives me that nostalgia from it. But at the same time, I'm like, I like my black cement threes. Do I really want to get these? I would probably get these literally just to take a photo. No. And then I'd be like, I'm on to the next You're thing. You're gonna wear these. I don't know. This shoe. I like the classic OG colorway. And you don't have to cover it up. I like the classic the OG The other ones colorway. you need to cover up with some pants. These you can wear shorts. Okay, okay, all right. <laughs> true, true. This go with half your new gear you just came out with. <laughs> yeah, true, like true. now, you're okay. like thinking about it. Now you know I might be able to make that yeah, work. You get some fits put together now. <laughs> okay. We got two more shoes left. Air Jordan 38 Center Star. All orange. I don't like orange, so you know for me it's immediate pass, but it looks better when it's just all one color compared red. to like the different. If they did all red, it would be hard. For sure. If they did a red Nike Jordan brand, if you do a red in this, all red, it's going to kill them. This yeah. right here is gonna sit. You're not gonna sell this shoe. <laughs> yeah, that's not the one. That's not it. Bad color. 
It's not. It's, it's not the model. It's, it's the color. The color. <laughs> <laughs> and then they did three different oranges in there. Right. Okay. <sighs> Last and final one. Classic OG. I need these in my life. Air Jordan Eight playoffs. The thing about the eight is. You gotta get two pairs. These? <laughs> oh yeah, we need multiples. I remember when we got these way back. What was that? 2007. Oh yeah, back in the day. And then oh, the retro came out again, like 2012 or 13 or something. We got like that. those two. We got those two. <laughs> but the 2007. From then on, like the memories. I remember you beat yours. I was gonna say this shoe. You can dog this shoe. You beat yours so. Cr it was so <laughs> crazy. <laughs> His pair it was, was so faded, cooked, everything. And he was like, can you clean these? No. I was like, no, <laughs> there's no going for back. For the win. I was like, there's no going back. It was for back. the win. Hey, these shoes, I'm telling you, they was indestructible. Air Jordan 8 playoff, classic OG. You can't yeah. go wrong. Great hoop shoe back in the day. I don't know hoop about Hoop well, now. wear well. Uh, Style, like I said, you can beat it up. Comfort. And then you can clean it real quick. Just bap, 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 bap. And you'd be ready to go again. I cleaned, remember, well, you cleaned it most of the time, but then when I started cleaning, it was faded. That's when he messed up. It was faded. At that moment, he knew. <laughs> I was using Irish Spring on there. <laughs> <laughs> it was like Irish Spring with a little bit of Axe. <laughs> he was like freshening it up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so to I recap, did use the, Irish Spring there. No, I. <laughs> I get it on the bar. Let's hope it up real good. That is here. crazy. All right, recap the month. Red Cement Air Jordan Four. That's a cop for you. You like yeah. that one? Yeah, for sure. Really, there's not that many releases. You got the Lucas. You got the Lucas. I mess with the Lucas. Okay. I want the school colors. All three of those. All three of those. Okay, so the PSG Six, the Shetney Five, and then the Air Jordan Eleven Low. Yeah. And then you'll go with the Jordan 2, yep. Black Cement, and then the Playoff 8. So we got six pairs of oh, shoes. Oh, that's actually cool. Yeah, it's like half of the I shoes. I got like two, three, <laughs> maybe four. You said Luca. You said uh But I, I like them, but I wouldn't cop. And the, uh, you the, wouldn't cop the Lucas? I would go J Balvin, uh, Air Jordan 8, and... <laughs> That was it. <laughs> yeah. That's probably you like, like the Lucas, but you said you want to cut I would actually spend more money on the J Balvin's and the eights. Like, that would be it, probably. Them J Balvin's. I like the Lucas. Good. I like the Lucas. I look, you need a, I want to do a basketball test. In the comments, I want to see how many people I need 10 people to say one way or another. Just say J Balvin or the Lucas. That's a huge difference right there on a no because the lucas is clean i get it but it's like performance basketball lifestyle hype collaboration just, hey they look at it, all of it i they gonna it. buy it all okay well that's about it um <laughs> make sure you guys subscribe to his channel we're gonna have some after uh clips that every time we shoot these videos we shoot extra clips that go on his channel oh, yeah, some yeah. behind the scenes stuff I got some new PEs. Uh oh. I was gonna show you guys, but it, you gotta, gotta subscribe go to, my to his channel, channel to see so you can watch it. He be having heat. Well, on my channel, he be showing <laughs> the heat. I got Woo! some stuff. Again, shopdnashow.com. We got new merch dropping often. You see the gear? I know you see it. We out here. Oh man. All right. Tell him you got anything before we go. Hey, every city we go to, man, we were supposed to shout out. Hold on, I gotta do this one time real fast. We were supposed to go to Tampa. Tampa, Tampa this week. And it was all bad. Yeah. The weather, man. Like, I feel bad for the people, for everything real. else. For real. We got to stay here in comfort. But, uh, man, I hope they get it together out there. For sure. You know, so for I feel sure. bad for them. But that's it. I would say love, peace, hair grease, and, uh, you know, shopdna.com. And every time, every time we hit the, what? Podcast. I was going to say that, but I didn't know if you wanted to say that. We got the podcast. I didn't, I didn't know if you wanted to say that. <laughs> the podcast yet. coming soon. The podcast is here. No, no. We already shot two episodes. The podcast is here. It's coming soon. And I'm I'm happy about this. It's, man, it's going to be I'm about fun. to have some fire guests on there. I've been talking to some people at Nike. They're like, yo, I'm down to get on. We're yeah. about to have some legends on there. Yeah. So this is going to be dope. Something yep. inside stuff. Man. All right. Stay tuned, behind the scenes coming Check soon. the behind the scenes, I'll see y'all. Love, peace, hair grease. Ooh. Ooh, nice. Those are so clean. Yep, we'll see that on the other channel. <laughs> <laughs>
I would never let you down. Yo, before you go, I just launched my Sneakerhead Academy where we got everything on the inside. I teach you all the stuff that I learned over the past 15 years when it comes to sneakers, scaling, real estate, you name it. We talk about all of it in there. And there's an eight-week program plus a bunch of monthly giveaways. I give away shoes literally way too much, honestly. But either way, I'll see you guys on the inside. Hit the link down below in my description or pinned in the comment section for DJ Sneakerhead Academy. And I'll see you guys over there. Listen, my DNA, hey, the hey, only hey, choice hey, I like to make what I'm aware today. One I would never let you down, it's in my DNA The only choice I like to make what I'm aware today I was made for it, it's in the DNA I was made for it, it's in the DNA I was made for it, it's in the DNA The only choice I like to make what I'm aware today OG status in my class